How's Uranus? Bleeding. I was talking about the planet. <laughs> Hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions unit. It's I'm Corbin. Um, um, uh, yeah. And you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thank you for us on Patreon. So juicy. Exclusive content there, non cut up stuff there, blocked content there. And uh, so thank you for those of us on Patreon and follow us on our own personal YouTube channels. Links always in the description below. Don't let Rick's face scare you. Hey, what you drinking there? There's somebody right now who's watching this and you're totally freaking out because you know I'm looking right in your cup of chai. What's got going on there? Hmm? Gross. Uh, today we are watching a Canada trailer. Um, it's called Rangit Aranga. Is that how you pronounce that? It was close enough, man. Rengitaranga. We're gonna have to have some kind of a ceremony, like to like lay to rest Corbinizations. You suck. I know, uh, but it's English translated to, I believe, "Colorful Wave." It's a 2015 Indian Ooh. Canada language mystery thriller film written and directed by Anup uh, Banarduri in his debut. Um, and before we get into this, let us know which next Canada film. We've only watched one. I know we need to watch more. I'm trying to watch more. In case you haven't noticed this whole year, I'm trying to get more regional stuff. But I'm trying to fill all those boxes from all of them. And there's a lot. <laughs> um, but uh, the only one we've seen is KGF. And we're very excited about KGF 2. But I know there's more that we need to watch. So let us know down below which one we should watch next. And so this is for me. this is technically called Colorful Wave. I believe that's what the translation is. Yes. Well, that makes me think that it's either about a gay club in Miami or a really successful surfer in Hawaii. Are you ready? Yes. Three, two, one. <laughs> Namadwe Samudra Dolge Underwater Andre Madwe Batene Reshmi Sire Odwe Nin Silk Panche Adela But Nirolgade Gautam One Kedre Nuts Kurtia Bumi Akasha Nantale Niniladia Nanjotenadia Train Nali the Red Country Booka given information Sundara Chandira Mogada Vishara de Bandare Tondere Yendava Manda Buddhia Manava. Ilen Martedia Nanin Nehurtaide Manisha Salpa Vichitra Ali Livodar Tertare Yena Nurukundo Ili Nadu Yella Vishagale Nivu Utra Hurkoda stone the soup tavala Yenatru Vichitra and Tansadre Mother in Dari would do away with Biddy. A camera to Mana in the Hanks Miss Sagadala. Adal ninde na dro kai vada. Amneli angar na bhutam tu. Adre ava sabd mile. Ibur li vichitra vada ke dekhar milte nahi. Oh, nenge no artha chala. I'm totally confused. Nene no artha artha dia. I mane le no ida gautam. Police naman hurtta idar hai. Sumne huchu chag matar bada. Naan matar bhe kare bhai hak bada. Yeli zaro. Utidio, Sutidio, Ninege good. Nanin Nejvaklu Yaranta good. Oh. 
second half of the trailer was way better than the first half. Yeah, I have a, I have only one concern, only one, because it's it looks interesting to me for sure. I loved um, the 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 music. I loved the premise. But stupid babies, you need to let us know. Was this sync sound or dubbed? Mm, yeah, I was no, I was noticing that too. It feels dubbed. Yeah. And, and uh, for those of you, for those of you who don't know what those terms are, when we say dubbed, we're not talking about what most people think about when we say dubbed. Because what most people think about when you say dubbed, it would be you're watching sacred games that was shot in Hindi, and they hire actors to speak in English and cut the sound out. That is a form of dubbing, but there is this proliferation in some of Indian cinema that just I cannot stomach, and it is it is the not doing synchronized sound, which they called sync sound, where you actually have a boom operator and a sound designer and you're filming the sound on set. They film everything without sound. No sound crew, nobody's mic'd, and then they add all dialogue and all Foley work afterwards so that the all the sounds you get are post-production. And I can't sit, I, I've tried, I just, I can't sit through movies that are that are not real sound. I don't know why they do that either. You think it saves money? Yeah. Oh, it's weird. How many issues how many issues do you have where you have to fix sound? You have to do ADR work after the fact because you didn't get good sound. You have to hire the crew to do the sound. Uh, and and if, if you have if somebody botches a line or there's a plane that flies overhead, you don't have to deal with any of those things. But it takes away all believability for me because everything I see in here, there was one movie I tried to watch and the guy talking it, it, the voice didn't even really seem to match him, and I could hear he was in a sound booth. It just kills me. <laughs> yeah, it's almost just like, because we don't watch dubbed films. Like, if it's shot in Tamil, we want to watch it in Tamil. We don't want right. to watch it, like, in a Hindi dubbed. We don't, because uh, we think it takes away from the actual performance, and that does as well. It takes away, because it's not, even though it's him saying it, it's him a different time saying it. Yes. And so and even might... the way that you can there's there's no the sound itself it just doesn't sound like the real you don't have the, one of the things they do is they get the ambient noise of the room when they're filming and they capture that so that they can make you feel like your sound is a massive contributor to the believability of a film. Yeah. And so yeah. Anyways, yeah. So hopefully this know. is not done. Uh but uh, the other than that, I think some of the visuals in this were really really fantastic. Really really good. Uh really cool looking uh and that definitely made me interested in it. Um and then some of the the song there at the end, it reminded me of something from uh, KGF. Yeah, it did. Uh which when is KGF2 coming out? I think it's got pushed obviously because of coronavirus. Yeah, they're waiting they're waiting until they can fit as many people as possible in a theater before they let that bad boy go, because that's going to be a blockbuster. Because I think it was supposed to come out in, like, December, but I don't know if it will. Yeah, like, this year. I don't know if it will now, um, which hopefully... I wouldn't... If, come on, if you were a producer on that film, would you want it to be released right now? Heck no. No, no smaller films that don't need that... That's a film that needs to be seen on the big screen because of how, how massive the scale is. Other films like Guabo Zutabo, which is a much smaller, intimate film, yeah. those can be straight to streaming because, you know, a lot of us have bigger TVs now, and so you can, can kind of... It's not the exact same, but it's kind of uh, comparable um, to what you can get. Um, but um, you can let us know how this is and let us know what next uh, Canada film, because I want to watch another Canada film. I know we've... Not on purpose, but it's been neglected. We don't... <laughs> Once again, for those who need to hear this, we don't have any bias against any language. We don't speak Hindi. Why? Like, you really don't, guys. Like, we have to read the subs for all of them. And so they make no difference yeah. to us what language it speaks. <laughs> like, at all. Like, it's all languages we don't know. <laughs> So, like, I don't understand how you think we can have a bias against something that I have to read subs regardless. <laughs> Yep, and we say it over and over again. It has to do with the availability of something for us to be able to see it. Sometimes we there's so many factors, and yes, we recognize it and say it all the time. 
there are areas that are underrepresented by a long shot. And we're, we really do want to represent everybody, guys. We really, really do. <laughs> so let us know. Really do. Thank you. <laughs> Da din din 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 da din din